Hey guys, my name is Elijah and in today's tutorial I will show you how to use Pictory video creation made easy by AI. It's very simple and straightforward guys, so first thing you need to do is click on the link in this video description and it will take you uh, to this Pictory.ai. Now keep in mind that Pictory is free for three videos, so you can create three free videos and then you have to subscribe to their plans, as you can see now. And by using the link in the description and promo code WORKOUT55, you have a 20% off of your subscription. So use that and thank you for support, supporting me like this. Now let's head straight to the tutorial. So first thing you need to do is get started for free. As you can see, no credit card required, so click on that. And then you have to log in with your Google account or just use email and your own password. So I am already signed in with my Google, so I will click on continue with Google and it will load up this page. Here, as you can see, you, have, you can choose which content would you like to repurpose into videos. You have options script to video, article to video, edit videos using text or visuals to video. This AI is pretty sick, so I will show you how to do that. Right up here you have my projects, so you can browse through your current projects, help, and you can upgrade here to your subscription. So first I will show you how to script to video. So you will need to click on proceed. And now here you enter your video name and here you enter the script. So for that you can for example use ChatGPT and you can write here write me to video script for video titled three free alternatives to Premiere Pro, for example. Then you copy this title and paste title of the video right here. So command V and here you have to paste the script. So wait while ChatGPT uh, will do the scripting and then copy it. As you can see ChatGPT is done creating my script. So I will now select it. Press con command C, go over to my pick tree, command V. And now I can get rid of some of things I don't want here. So let's say this conclusion, I will delete that. I don't want this here. And now when you are done, just click on proceed right here. Then you can easily choose a template that you really like. So let's say you can browse through them. And let's say I really like this flashlight one. So you will click on select then. Now you choose your aspect ratio if you want to use it for computer, phone or a square like this for Instagram and etc. So I will use it 16 by 9. Click continue. And as you can see, it will say watermarks. Don't worry, the sorry blocks watermarks you are seeing are only present in preview mode. They won't be included in your final video, which is nice. And then as you can see, you can close this. And here you have your scenes written out. As you can see, I have 32 scenes. You can scroll through them right here. And you can see which videos it have picked for your uh, scenes. And you can preview it with this button. Now this video is very shallow when it when there is no voiceover over it. So if you want to add voiceover, it's really simple. You can record your own voiceover with this button right here. Record voiceover. You can upload voiceover or you can do AI voiceover. So it's really simple. Just go over here to audio and then choose voiceover tab right here and then pick your voice. So I can browse through them. Welcome to Pictory. It has been shown this is the that first video one. increase. Welcome to Pictory. This is another. It has been you shown can that have video a female as well. Welcome to Pictory. It has been shown that Welcome to Pictory. And I really like it this one, so I will use it. Click on Apply. Rate by 80%. And then when you click Apply, you can preview it again. Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about three free alternatives to Premiere Pro, the popular video editing software. Now that, does, that was the scene one. You can also preview scene two, scene three, and whatever you like, you can watch the whole video. Here you can see estimated video duration, which in my instance is 3 minutes 32 seconds. And you can set scene duration right here. So you can set how long you want to be the one scene. And right here you can choose background music. It will choose the one for you, but you can 
easily change it right here by clicking this apply on any music you want and preview it with this button. If you want to customize your video, you can choose your own videos, photos and templates right here. You can upload it and here you have recent elements that you have used and here you have heart and everything that you press hard on that is your liked elements it will appear right here here you have volume you can choose volume of your background music and volume of your voiceover so let's say i will increase this one and increase this one as well a bit as you can see changes have been saved so you can go back to text and as you can see here you can adjust your text you have styles as well so intro style outro style and the default scene style and you have also styles library so you can browse through all of these styles and pick the one that you like if your template isn't isn't your cup of tea then you have branding so you can enable intro here and it will enable this intro scene that you can customize as well you can choose your logo intro text and intro visual as well then you have format and here you can pick 16 by 9 9 by 16 or 1 to one and choose if you want the video to be 720p or 1080p which is full hd then up here in the visuals tab you can change your visuals and search through other ones if you don't like the ones that ai has given to you there's really a lot of them just search in the search bar or pick categories and types that you want in this story tab you can reorder your scenes just by dragging right here and moving the scenes where you want them to be. In my instance, I will leave them as it is because I like how they are. And then you can easily edit the text script of your video right here when you click in the scene. And let's say I will delete these numbers because I don't want them to be in my script. In order to export your video now, you have to click here on download, click on download and then video right here. It will process and generate your video. So you have to wait a bit and then you can preview it. And as you can see, your video is now ready. Video is saved under my projects. So we can copy link, export audio or export text, or just download your video right here. So I will do that. I will click download and we'll wait while it downloads. And this is the final video. Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about three free alternatives to Premiere Pro, the popular video editing software. We understand that not everyone has the budget to pay for expensive software, and that's why we're going to show you some options that won't cost you a penny. DaVinci Resolve. The first alternative we're going to talk about is DaVinci Resolve. This software is a complete video editing solution that includes color correction, audio editing, and visual effects. It's been used in Hollywood productions, so you know it's a powerful tool. DaVinci Resolve has a free version, which has a lot of the same features as the paid version. Some of the features include Advanced trimming tools Multicam editing Fairlight audio Fusion effects The second alternative we're going to talk about is Shotcut. Shotcut is an open-source, cross-platform video editor that is free to use. It has a simple and intuitive interface, making it a great option for beginners. Some of the features of Shotcut include Supports a wide range of video formats No import required, native timeline editing Audio mixing and editing Video effects and filters keyframes for filter animation. The last alternative we're going to talk about is Blender. Blender is primarily a 3D animation software, but it also includes a video editor. The video editor is a full featured tool that can handle basic editing tasks and it's free to use. Some of the features of Blender's video editor include Live Preview, Luma Waveform, Chroma Vectorscope, and Histogram Displays. Audio Mixing, Syncing, Scrubbing, and Waveform Visualization. Up to 32 slots for adding video, images, audio, and effects. Speed Control, Adjustment Layers, Transitions, 
keyframes, filters, and more. So there you have it, three free alternatives to Premiere Pro that you can use for your video editing needs. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced editor, these tools can help you create great content without breaking the bank. Don't be afraid to try them out and see which one works best for you. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. So this is how you create script to video in Pictory. Don't forget to use my promo code WORKOUT55 and click on my link in the description to sign up in Pictory AI. Thank you guys for watching. If this video was helpful to you, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel and I will see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye.